Hey, KS Services is now running their $59 fall tune-up special. Our team arrives on time and is always professional. Be sure your unit is ready for the cooler temperatures by visiting our website, callks.com today, and schedule your appointment. It's fast and easy. The weather's getting cooler and the days are getting shorter. Don't let the fall weather sneak up on you. Call us today. 205-322-9090, AL certification number 1112. This is the Weather Extreme video, the morning edition. This is for Thursday, the 2nd of November. I'm James Spann. Temperatures trending warmer in coming days. In fact, we'll be close to 80 by the weekend. It's some risk of showers each day. Nothing too heavy or too widespread. Let's check it out. There's the water vapor satellite view. Got a trough over the northern states. Pretty cold up north, but this time that cold air is going to be shunted more to the east and not to the south. And down here, a pretty moist air mass in place. That was the radar at 5.05 this morning. A few little small showers in scattered pockets across the state. And we'll see scattered showers around today. But again, I would not call it exactly a rainy day, but just be ready for a passing shower from time to time. Starting off the day in the upper 50s and low 60s in most spots, Birmingham at 63, Gadsden the cool spot, and Auburn, they both got 57. There's the watch warning map, winter storm watches and warnings in effect for parts of Montana, Wyoming, Washington State, Idaho, that's where the cold air is going to be. Down here, things are relatively quiet. No severe weather expected today, maybe some thunder over northwest Alabama, but I think most of the state just with scattered rain showers today. Tomorrow, maybe some thunder for the Tennessee Valley, but again, no severe weather. And on day three, which is Saturday, thunder up north, no thunder expected down here. All those showers are possible. This is the rain for the next seven days. Nothing for the southern third of the state, places like Mobile, Atmore, Andalusia, Dothan. About a half inch possibly for Tuscaloosa, Birmingham, Anniston, Gadsden. Maybe one inch for areas north of the Tennessee River up in extreme north Alabama. And the tropics again this morning, quiet. Got a few weeks left of the hurricane season. We will be done for this year. All right, model fans, here we go. The GFS, this is the 06C run, valid this afternoon at 1 o'clock. You can see the troughing up north. That's where the cold air will be today. And again, some snow likely up in that zone. But down here, a lot of clouds around, maybe a few showers. And temperatures warming up. Yesterday, we stayed in the low and mid-60s much of the day. That's way below average. We ought to be at 70 at this time of the year. I think we'll probably see low to mid-70s today. And again, the chance of showers. This is the high-res HER model at 6 o'clock this evening. Not showing a lot. The better chance of showers if this verifies over northwest Alabama. Pretty much the same deal tomorrow. A mostly cloudy day. Mild. Highs up in the 70s. The chance of showers. This is the high-res NAM ballot tomorrow evening at 8 o'clock during the high school football games. And it's not very bullish on showers for those games tomorrow night. Could there be a shower? Yes. You might want to take the rain gear to be on the safe side, but I just don't think rain is going to be a big issue. Hey, Saturday starting off the weekend. Pretty much the same story. Mostly cloudy. And the warming trend continues. We'll be close to 80 Saturday afternoon. The sun might peak out at times. And again, there could be a few showers about. Let's check the high-resolution NAM. This is valid Saturday at 1 o'clock, and it's not bullish on showers. It doesn't have much at all. Let's check the European. This is Saturday evening at 7 o'clock. You know, Alabama's got a home game against LSU, and the European is not bullish on rain. And again, we stress for, for that ball game, could there be a shower? Yes. Will it be a big issue? We don't think so. Uh, no thunder expected. Anything that forms should be light, and it wouldn't last long. And there's a chance the game could be played with no rain at all. All right, let's go to Sunday. Trending drier as the upper high strengthens, and again, we might see low 80s on Sunday. The sky partially sunny. Same thing Monday, and really the same thing Tuesday. Uh, so Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday looking warm and mostly dry with the rain holding north of us. And then Wednesday, a cold front passes on through. So at some point, Tuesday night or maybe Wednesday morning, we might see some rain with that, although this run not showing much. And a 1032 high pressing in that's over the Midwest. That looks uh, like some pretty good cool air dropping in here. And this is a week from today, Thursday the 9th, the trough that brought the cool air moving on by a new trough in the western states. And if this is right, we are cool and dry. 
temperatures go below average for uh, the latter half of next week. So we start the week with low 80s. We wrap up the week. We might see highs in the upper 50s on a few days there. This is the end of the forecast period. Saturday, 11-11, November 11th. Pretty good trough carving out north and west of the state. Looks like a cold front may be passing through early in the day. And then a new surge of cool air. Check the numbers coming off the GFS Ensemble. Highs well up in the 70s through early next week. And again, we might see numbers a bit warmer than that. We might see some low 80s. But then note the big cool down with highs possibly dropping into the upper 50s by Thursday of next week. And after that, highs around 60 and lows down in the 40s. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Hey, KS Services is now running their $59 fall tune-up special. The weather's getting cooler and the days are getting shorter. Don't let the fall weather sneak up on you. Call us today. 205-322-9090, AL certification number 11120.